Hey guys, welcome to Complete Grid Solution. In this video, we are going to discuss a problem which is related to coordinate geometry. The problem is if points 1, 2, minus 1x and 2, 3 are collinear, then what is the value of x? So, there are plenty of methods uh, possible to solve this problem. Then, then let's discuss the first method. As we know that if point A B and C are collinear then we have a relation in ABC which is AB plus BC is equals to AC. A simple words we can say three points form a straight line so sum of two is always equals to third one. If we use this method to solve this problem so it is going to be very difficult to solve. Let's think about another plan. When we look around three points like A, B and C, so first thing which came in our mind is that these points can make a triangle. Now we have to find the area of this triangle. If three points are given in coordinate geometry then the area of triangle nothing but it is half times x1 times y2 minus y3 plus x2 y3 minus y1 plus x3 y1 minus y2 so we can assign this one is x1 y1 x2 y2 and x3 y3 so after substituting the values we get half 1 x minus 3 minus 1 3 minus 2 plus 2 2 minus x so area of triangle is equals to nothing but half x minus 3 minus 1 plus 4 minus 2x so area of triangle is minus 3 minus 1 is also 4 so we get minus x by 2 as we know area never be negative so we can use uh, area of this triangle is x by 2 but wait points are collinear and collinear forms a straight line if we draw a straight line then area of this triangle should be 0 so area of triangle should be 0 that means x by 2 should be 0 so x should be 0 so by this formula we can solve this problem easily that x is 0. Now look at another solution which is what? We can use similarity or trigonometry to solve this problem also. So we draw a graph. So first point is what? 1, 2. Let's say this point is 1, 2. Second is minus 1x. So minus 1 obviously lies left hand side of this point. So Let's say this point is minus 1x. So 2, 3 obviously lies right to this point. So here we can assume 2, 3. If points are collinear, then they form a straight line like this. So as we know about the coordinate geometry, when we read a points, we drop some perpendiculars. So we can say this length is 1 unit and this is also 1 unit, which is x distance coordinate of these two points and this one is completely two unit so the remaining one is one unit this complete one is three unit and this one is two unit so this is what one unit and this distance is nothing but two minus x unit because of this distance is x unit and lines are perpendicular to each other in a graph we know that so we can say these two triangles let's say a b c p and q triangle a b p is similar to triangle b c q by double a property if these two triangles are similar so we can get ratio of corresponding sides of these triangles this is what 2 minus x upon 1 is equals to after 
simplification we can easily get that x is equals to 0. Here we can also use trigonometry that uh, we know that if this angle is theta then this one is also theta and the relation between sides is perpendicular and base which is represented by tan theta. So in the first triangle we can say tan theta is equals to nothing but 2 minus x upon 2 and in the second triangle tan theta is equals to 1 upon 1. So both angles are equal so obviously the ratio of uh, tan is also equal so 2 minus x by 2 is also equals to 1 by 1 so after solving this we can get x is equals to 0.